Yeah. <laughs> the Federal Security Agency mm-hmm. supervised Social Security and welfare activities. Oh. Mm-hmm. Now, um, it looks like we, we brought in 12 million men and women. Yeah. <laughs> You know, for those in Homeland Security that said you you couldn't be removed, yeah. <laughs> let's say I wanted the United States military to kind of take over what you do, yes, and put it back into the Department of Defense. <laughs> now, obviously, with 1.2 million American citizens right, in active duty, <laughs> that would be the Army, uh-huh, the Navy, ooch, the Air Force, mm-hmm. And the Marines, but we might not include the National Guards because of the refusal to enforce civil rights. Yes. <laughs> what if we looked at the actual number of employees of uh, Homeland Security? Yes. <laughs> Those in the United States Coast Guard. Mm. I emailed you. Yes. Those in the Secret Service. Yes. Those in the Department of um, <laughs> Border Patrol. Pooh. <laughs> Now, what we could do, yes, is we could maybe employ another 500,000 men and women. Yes. <laughs> and then we could remove a department of the United States of America. <laughs> now, if you hadn't thought about it, okay, this might be a good day to do this. <laughs> if you wanted to go Army, Army strong, why don't you go to a recruiting station and say, well, I think that the military should actually be defending the nation. Yes. And they should take over all these terrorism fusion centers. Yeah. <laughs> and you want to learn about radio communications. Uh, you want to learn about frequencies. Right. <laughs> you want to learn <laughs> about the Internet. <laughs> now, let's say you're in the Navy. <clears throat> you're one of these that says, well, <laughs> we don't need the Coast Guard. Yeah, we could do what they're doing. <laughs> We're going to need a few new recruits in the Army, the Navy, the Air Force, and the Marines. <laughs> Now, the Air Force seems to have a lot of satellite communications, and if you haven't tested to be in the military, yes. I think if we added an additional 500,000 individuals in the Army, Navy, Air Force, and Marines, yeah, we could do away with Homeland Security, and a lot of these independent agencies that got started in, uh, in Roosevelt's administration, yeah. Because my thought was, well, every time we remove a department from the actual cabinet of the executive branch, yeah, it simplifies things. Now, tomorrow is Monday. Pooch, why don't you visit right now the Armed Shabbat Shabbat of the United States of America?